I studied the works of Piaget and Vygotsky. These men had very different theories about child development. Piaget believed that children and young adults develop in four basic stages. From birth to two years old, a child's biggest milestone is understanding object permanence. From two to seven, a child will learn that visual changes don't always affect reality. In the video I watched, it showed um, a child looking at a line of quarters and there were the same amount of quarters in each line, but if they stretched one out longer, the child thought that there must be more in that line. From ages seven to 11, the child can now fully grasp the concrete and has a good understanding of what their five senses will tell them. However, it's not until 11 years of age and upward that they can master abstract thinking about things that they haven't seen yet. Vygotsky rejected Piaget's theory of stages. Instead, he presented the idea that while every child will eventually hit these milestones, they could be achieved or learned sooner with correct, a proper outside support. His biggest philosophy was one called proximal development. That meant that outside social and emotional support would directly affect how quickly a child can learn. In fact, Vygotsky believed that a child could actually learn something before the development that's required for that concept has happened. An example might be that a child could learn certain gross motor skills before that natural development would have taken place if the environment is set up in a way that supports that um, by like a parent or a mentor or a guide or even technology that gives that child the, um, the step ahead in those skills. Um, uh, this would actually end up distinguishing them from other children and they would be more skilled in the processes of developing because of this. He also attributed the, abil the ability to think and to reason internally with the influence of modeled external conversations. He believed that social interaction would help develop a perspective within the child um, that they need from those conversations with people of their own age, people that are older than them. So...